This is Debbie Cordon and her son, James. This guy, James, who is my son, he's 12 today. James has autism. You know, you go out into public and your child starts acting up and he's a big kid. They're going to think he's a brat and I don't know how to discipline him. Cordon is constantly being judged while she's out in public with her son, which made her realize something. He needed a place where he could go and feel comfortable and, you know, we saw a need that, where do we go? That idea created this, Fantastic Friends, an organization that holds social events for children with special needs to celebrate their differences. The disabilities checked at the door and they can have fun and just be who they are. At today's event, held at the Ellicott Square building, over 50 children with special needs were allowed to be creative painting, make some new friends, and even meet a special guest. It's a time for these kids to just be kids, something Jamie Swanson what did you feel? really appreciates. We're just accepted the way that we are, and that I really think the child is the disability is checked at the door. Fantastic Friends began over a year and a half ago and already has 150 members. At each event, every special needs child is paired with a volunteer, giving the parents a break. So we're able to actually sit, relax, enjoy, and be like a typical parent. Sit, relax, and watch their kids have some fun. Yeah, it's very creative. It's amazing the creativity that he has. In Buffalo, Jeff Slauson, 7 Eyewitness News.